Warning. This game contains jump scares, flashing lights, scary and disturbing content. Hey everybody, welcome back. Today we're playing a SpongeBob meme horror game called Red Mist. This is my life now. On 7th of January 2000, Squidward was found dead in his house by his friends SpongeBob and Patrick. The Bikini Bottom police started an investigation, but could not find any evidence of a possible murderer and assumed it was a suicide as the gun was in one of Squidward's hands. A few days later, Spongebob and Patrick were reported missing, last seen entering Squidward's house in the middle of the night. As the Bikini Bottom police uh, continued the investigation, a secret cellar door was unveiled in Squidward's house. You play as one of the police officers of the Bikini Bottom police. You have to enter the cellar. Will you unveil the truth? All right, uh, we are in Squidward's house. We are a police investigator. The house is... <laughs> the graphics are all popping as I look around. Uh, what am I doing exactly? Am I, I can sprint down this giant hallway. Can I use the flashlight? Does it work? I don't I don't know if it works. Is this a flashlight? It looks like Lego. It looks like I have a stamina bar, I just realized. Item 07. I have to collect things. Is this something I can take? It it works, but I can't I can't pick it up. This Squidward is living in a mansion. He's been withholding all his money this whole time, not even sharing with SpongeBob or Patrick. <gasps> that looks like a SpongeBob leg. That looks like a SpongeBob leg or maybe a, a field hockey stick. It kind of looks like a field hockey stick, not gonna lie. So does that mean SpongeBob is up here with one leg hopping around or is he actually not here? Oh, <gasps> Squidward's flute. I took it. I could take the flute. Oh, I can't take the leg, can I? There's no way. No, I'm, I'm clicking and yeah, I guess I, I I guess I don't want SpongeBob's leg, if that is even SpongeBob. So what's down here? Is there also a mer This place is massive. He was? He was what? Where's the rest of the sentence? Oh, here's a, another leg. He was, here's Sponge. I was gonna say, here's SpongeBob's other leg, and then look like the ghost of Squidward came up. Wrong? He was wrong? Oh no. What happened to SpongeBob? SpongeBob, no! <gasps> uh, conch shell? I can take it. I have, hold on, I have no stamina. Does it not replenish? Did I waste all the stamina just wandering around already? We only have two out of seven items. Uh, this is not going to be good. This is... What is that so What is that sound? SB129. What? What's SB129? Also, can I take this? SpongeBob's hat? SB129. But what does it all mean? Okay, well, unfortunately, I can't sprint anymore. So now I have to slowly walk through Squidward's giant mansion. I haven't really seen any bad guys yet, which is not a bad thing. Also, if I have this flashlight, why can't I use it? Or is this like me looking? Oh, wait, wait, wait. I just realized I thought the, the textures were blinking. It's the flashlight lighting it up as I look around. It's auto enabled. It's just a really weird way to use it, I think. Oh no, is this is this who I think it is? Is this is this Patrick? <laughs> this is Patrick. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. R.I.P. F's in the comments for Patrick. Oh, what's this? That's SpongeBob's net. His butterfly net. Okay, we have four out of seven items. We haven't. Why is there a stamina bar if I don't need to sprint? This way is closer. I'm gonna go this way first. I'm probably making a horrible mistake. Oh, jeez. Okay. Um. Oh my goodness. Hold on. It says stop, but I'm, I'm gonna pick this up. Wait. Can I pick this up? It kind of looks like another hat or a flashlight, or it's a flashlight looking at Patrick's body. Wait. Was that Patrick's head we saw back there, and this is his body? Oh, this is terrible. Who did this to SpongeBob and Patrick? And is there any additional items back here that I can pick up? Because I need I need me loot. I need me some loot. 
I don't think so. Can't take any of these cans or anything. I don't think there's anything back here. This is just literally a place to unfortunately see. Wait, 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 what's this? Is this the note? I I clicked it, but I can't read it. It's just a thing. I don't think it counted as an item. Did it? Were we always at five out of seven? I don't remember. Anyway, we need two more items. We're at five of seven. This is a very long hallway. What's this on the wall here? Uh, truth is near. I don't I don't know if I want to know the truth. After seeing what happened to SpongeBob and Patrick, I really don't want the same fate. I I don't I don't know if I'm gonna like this. Ah! Okay, that looks a very a very cursed Squidward. Oh no, oh no, what's this? The death ending. There's multiple endings. After you have not returned from the basement, the Bikini Bottom Police decided to send a special force of police officers into the basement. They found the bodies of SpongeBob, Patrick, and you in a devastating condition. An investigation was started to explain the deaths, but no clues were found to what really happened. The case was closed a few months later, and the deaths remain a mystery to this day. Go back to the menu. We need the other endings! We need to do all the endings. How many endings is there? There must be a good ending where... Hold on, can I just leave? Is that an ending? I must have to get all the items. That has to be like the good ending. So maybe one of the endings is I have to outrun Evil Squidward at the end? One ending is definitely picking up all the items. And I'm guessing there's probably a secret ending too. I'm going to conserve my stamina and grab all the items if I can. That's the goal here. Oh, I totally missed this. Squidward's flute. Clarinet, sorry. It's a clarinet. Now, is there something hidden amongst the boxes here? That I might have missed the first time. Because I missed two items, from what I could tell. And I just found one of the ones I missed. Now, is there something else, though? I don't think so. He was. Oh, I forgot about that. All right, taking the shell. So we're at three out of seven. Where's the other one I missed? Yeah, SB129. What the crap is SB129? Four out of seven. Three more items to go. That must be, like, Patrick's head. That has to be. Which is a weird thing to say, actually. Is this his head? Oh, it is, because his eyes are crossed out. Oh, okay, that makes sense. What's down here? The butterfly net. Where items five. And then this one. There was a note back here. Lovely. I forgot about that again. Yeah, there's no. Is there the whole time? Great. Now, does this count as an item? It does count as an item. Perfect. Okay. So we need one more item. Did I pick up any items after this? I don't think I did. Yeah. Yep. Evil Squidward. We're going to start seeing him here. Now I'm going to run. Have all my stamina. Wait, did they change it into a forever hallway? No, they didn't. Oh, look. What's this? A stair? Uh, a ladder. It's a ladder. Go. Please stand by. The escape ending. You managed to escape the basement in the last second. You contacted the police station and told them what you have witnessed. In the basement, a special police force was sent to Squidward's house. They searched for the bodies of SpongeBob and Patrick, but they could not find anything. <gasps> Okay, so we have the the death ending, we have the escape ending. How many more endings could there be? One, two. Oh, this is where it was the entire time. It's a stupid spatula. Three, four, five, six, seven. Time to run from the monster. You're not going to catch me, evil Squidward. Not today, Satan. This is... This is new. Oh. The ladder's gone. Oh, it changed because we have all the items. Oh! We get to continue exploring. What? Is that Morse code? 
Five W F T D I Z nine Z Y. What? Truth is near, truth is near, truth is near, truth is near. Corrupted? It just says quit. There's not even a main menu button. Hold on. All right, guys, I did some digging about uh, that Morse code, weird corrupted ending that we had, and apparently it's a key uh, that used to be an old YouTube video that is no longer uploaded. So apparently what we have to do is go through the map collect all seven items and apparently there's also these three random buckets throughout the map that make like a ping sound as we go through them and then outrun Squidward which will be the SB129 ending apparently and apparently that is to do with some sort of like lost episode of Spongebob um now I'm not somebody who watches Spongebob so maybe you guys can let me know in the comments what that episode is if it's some sort of lore <gasps> that's one of them that's one of the sounds. Okay, we have found one of three buckets. Meanwhile, I have to keep just hitting every single bucket throughout this entire map. What was this one? <gasps> okay, there's our second bucket. Now we have to find one more bucket. <gasps> That's the third bucket. That is all the buckets, okay. So now we have to go down the hallway towards evil Squidward. And I don't know what happens from there. I don't know. I guess we just run and escape. I guess. Yep. Evil Squidward. Running away from cursed Squidward. All right, now we get to go down the hallway and hopefully we have a secret ending. Is this a door? That's different. It just said Mr. Krabs did it? SB129. SB129 ending. When you entered the SB129, you were teleported on the day of the Squidward assassination. You caught Mr. Krabs in the act when he tried to shoot Squidward. You overpowered and arrested Mr. Krabs. He was sentenced to prison for attempted murder for 25 years. To be continued? Wow! Plot twist, Mr. Krabs! Holy crap! Alright guys, that was the Cursed Spongebob Red Mist game. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe if you guys want to see more spooky indie horror content. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.